What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of My Ultimate Team. This is episode number 31 and we start today's episode off going straight into an online single matches. Now in the last episode I kind of discussed it a little bit but um, I think for the time being I'm just going to play online single matches. Now I know that some people would prefer divisions and that's fine. You know it's more, uh, how do I explain it, it's more entertaining I guess knowing that the uh, the uploader is has some stuff at stake. You know be it promotion, relegation or division titles and so on. Um, but to to be honest, I said in the last episode, I, I just I'm so much better in online single matches, and I know that some people won't believe me when I say that. You know, I think the opponents can be just as hard as those in the divisions, um, sometimes harder. But um, to be honest, I I just feel so much more comfortable going into these games, knowing that there's nothing at stake. You know, for me, it's more about the mentality side of it, and uh, just knowing there's no pressure on you whether you win, lose, or draw. It's it's such a relief for me, and it makes me play a little bit better in my opinion. But uh, anyway, we had the first chance of this game in the tenth minute. We came against the Serie A side, and uh, we took the lead as well, uh, the shot was saved, but uh, Sanjo got to it, and our captain made it 1-0 here. But in the 24th minute, Sanjo's onto the ball again, uh, gives it to Oscar. Oscar's running through the centre here, gets past him out with a lovely piece of skill, plays the ball through to like Remy, who's surely going to score, and he does just, uh, does do that. So it's a great finish by Remy, and uh, we're tuning it up 25 minutes into a really good start here. And um, yeah, again, I was, I was playing really well, what can I say? But uh, in the 39th minute here, this happens. Begovic launches a kick forward, and um, it was one of those where... I mean, I've seen this quite a few times on YouTube where the goalkeeper just kicks the ball up and it just goes straight to an attacker and there's no one in sight. It was really weird, but uh, Remy was through on goal and uh, the guy's defence was quite poor, to be honest. And we made it 3-0 here. And um, it, was, it was just completely all alone there. It was really weird, but uh, it was 3-0. And uh, just before the hour mark, Asaidi's on the ball. Uh, lovely fake Rabana and a wacker wacker. Then a heel-to-heel -heel flick. He, he nutmegs the defender, gets taken out. And, uh, of course, the referee's got no choice but to give Chiellini a book in and also give us a penalty. So that was a, a nice piece of skill by Asaidi. Uh, it's also with the skill as well. I feel so much more comfortable skilling in online single matches than um, in divisions because it's like I don't have to always get a goal at the end of it to make it useful, if you know what I mean. Like, even if I just go on a nice skill run and, and like that, get taken out, it's like, who cares? You know, it's just it's just fun. Um, so we get a penalty here. We were freeing it up and uh, Luke Remy is standing over the ball. So a good chance to get his hat-trick here. I think this was a hat-trick chance. And uh, Remy stands up and he He's counted. It's a good good penalty by Remy. That makes it 4-0. And um, I'm yet to miss a penalty on next gen as well. That's brilliant. So uh, Remy makes it 4-0. And uh, we get really lucky here. He, he, he runs through. He intercepted a free kick. He rainbow flicks the goalkeeper. And uh, Kakeros can only uh, put the ball into his own net. So that made it 5-0 with 76 minutes in. And in injury time here, a great chance to make it 6-0. Uh, ben Arthur runs down the right-hand side in injury time. Uh, nice little fake Rubano, ball roll fake, roulette, Ronaldo chop, heel to heel flick, Berberspin gets himself inside. Can he finish? No, it's just wide the post. So it, it uh, goes wide the post, but it does indeed finish at 5-0, so... <clears throat> It's great to get a win, um, and again, what can I say, I just feel so much more comfortable in online single matches, so I think for the time being, we're going to stick with them. You know, we're not going to win every single game, um, the same way we're not going to dominate every single game or, or lose every single game, it's, it's just going to be a, a nice, uh, what's the word of, What's the word I'm looking for here, kind of like a, a nice relaxing challenge, if you will. You know, I still want to win the games, but it's, it's more relaxing for me. But um, anyway, yeah, we won the game by five goals to nil, a couple of nice skill goals in there, uh, a nice runway Asaidi, and... And, um, no, it wasn't a skill goal, was there? There was a good skill chance. There was a nice skill run by Asadi that resulted in a goal. I should say that. And, um, yeah, it was, it was just nice to get a win. And uh, the following game, we decided to use our skill side. And the reason being is because the fitness was running low. And uh, to be honest, like, I am still thinking of building a third side just so I can rotate it all the time, keep rotating it constantly, and uh, make sure everyone gets a chance to look at some new teams and that instead of just using the same two teams. But I'm not really sure. I, I kind of just want to improve the sides I've got right now. You know, the skill team there's still room for improvement we can still get players like Mike on Leite and, and Wallison and um, you know I don't think we'll ever get the coins for it but players like Neymar but um, there's still room for that and of course the Premier League side there's room for real improvement as well you know obviously I want to improve the goalkeeper I want to get a better check uh, which I think we can already afford by now and um, you know better players up top as well instead of Loic Remy and so on but you know maybe someone like Van Persie but um, yeah I don't know maybe I will build another side but uh, we'll, we'll wait and see what happens but um, anyway we came to this game uh, we were 1-0 down but uh, I think it was Bernard made it 2-1 there and in the 90th minute Bernard intercepts a free kick goes down left hand side nice little burl spin gets around his man and puts it into the top corner so in injury time here we get the winning goal uh, Bernard makes it 2-1 and uh, I guess again this is exactly what I'm talking about the unpredictability of the online single matches I came into the game I've been playing really well you'd, you'd imagine me to easily win this game but we were struggling and 
and we needed the goal in the last minute to win it. So, you know, that's that's the best thing about it. So it was a nice goal by Bernard. It was a nice piece of skill and um, a simple piece of skill, really. But even so, it was good to get it. And uh, we won by two goals to one. So it, it, the most important thing is getting a win. But we also uh, score a nice little uh, goal with a, a Berber spin in there. And, uh, yeah, it was, it was nice to get a win. And uh, a 2-1 victory is the most important thing. And I should say, like, I will go back to divisions in time. I, I will go back to the divisions, um, you know, in a few episodes or so. But for the time being, I just want to play online single matches. Because I'm, I'm sure you guys would rather me rather watch me win as well. Do you know what I mean? I, I'm sure you guys would rather me... Uh, win more games than you know um, lose and draw most games because quite frankly that's at the moment that's what I'm doing in divisions you know I'm winning like one in three or four games whereas in the online single matches I'm winning like one out of two but uh, anyway uh, we came against this full uh, Arsenal side here so this guy was clearly a Spurs fan but um, we came against this side here and in the sixth minute we had our first chance uh, Oscar gets onto the ball finds Lloyd Graham he gets very very lucky as he gets past his man rolls it through to Ben Arthur Ben Arthur rounds the goalkeeper takes it away from Chesney nice little fake shot and finesses it into the corner. So that was a nice goal by Ben Arthur there. Some, uh, some nice composure to take it around the goalkeeper and a good finish as well. So 1-0 to us here in 8 minutes. And uh, in the 15th minute, Ben Arthur has a corner. It's crossed in because Shelney wins the header, hits the bar. And uh, Lloyd Karemi gets to the rebound and puts the ball into the back of the net. So 2-0 to us. And uh, we were playing quite well in this game. The guy didn't really turn up, to be honest. But uh, he started to get... This is kind of weird. He started to get uh, back into the game quite a bit. But on the stroke of half time, Oscar's onto the ball down the left-hand side here. Goes through 1-1. One one, tries to rainbow flick Chesney. He catches the ball and uh, the guy just drops the ball and he boots it into his own net and it's like don't get me wrong I've seen people do it before but it's like you're you're only 2-0 down and you weren't playing that badly and he just decided to do that and I was like that's like what's the point basically but uh, yeah like, as you can see by the stats it was relatively even and he just decided to give up on a stroke of half time so that was just odd but you know, I'm not going to complain. We got the win, but it's kind of odd when people do that. Like, I don't really see the point. You know, if, if he's got things to do, then fine. But you know, why boot it into the back of your own net? That just costs you more coins. But um, anyway, our uh, our fourth and final game. Uh, eventually, as we get into a game here, I found such difficulty searching for opponents on this night. It's um, I mean. Right now, it's uh, the 27th of December for me, and the weather has been really, really bad, of course, in the UK. I guess that's why, and um, it, it's kind of weird, though. There's there's, um, there's been a lot of problems with PSN as well. Obviously, that's due to the fact that so many people have been given a PS4 for Christmas, but uh, it, it's kind of weird. Like, it's been really hard to find opponents, and the connectivity's not been that great, or connection's not been that great, I should say. But uh, eventually, we came against this side, and uh, it was a really interesting side as well. Like I say, I, I like to face interesting sides, not just the, the typical sort of Bundesliga uh, pace of use side. But um, yeah, really good side here. Uh, full silver, one bronze and one gold. A Saudi league side. So really, really cool. But only three stars and 100 chemistry. So I did feel like I'd have the uh, better of this side. But still a, a very unique side. And I like coming against unique sides. And uh, we uh, started the game really brightly in the eighth minute. Uh, we got onto the ball here. It was Bakary Sanya. Rolls the ball through to Asaidi. Asaidi gets around his man and ends up blasting the ball into the top corner. So I was going to do some skill. But uh, quite frankly, I just wanted to get myself uh, an early goal and uh, relieve some pressure. So one it up in nine minutes. And in in the 12th minute, Eunice Kabul makes a great challenge. It's uh, Sanjo who gets onto the ball, plays it through uh, down the right hand side to Hatton Ben Arthur. Lovely strength put, uh, to put the defender on the floor. Nice little double step over here, gets himself inside. He's got a shooting opportunity and he takes it. It's a really good finish from just outside the area. Finesse it into the bottom corner and uh, that makes it 2 0 to us. So 13 minutes in, we were 2 0 in front and as you'd expect really, but uh, even so, it's good to be in the lead. And in the 76th minute, a nice back heel releases Sanjo here. The cross comes in and uh, this has got to be. One of the worst dives in Ultimate Team history. I have no idea why the referee gave us a penalty. Like, I think there probably was contact, but you got to watch this on the slow mo. This is hilarious. It's just like there's there's nothing there, and look at the way he falls over there. I have no idea how the referee could think that was a penalty. That was such a blatant dive by Oscar, but the referee gave it, and uh, I felt sorry for the guy because, like, seriously, if I was a referee, I would have probably sent Oscar off for that dive. It was that bad. But uh, Remy stepped up, and uh, we're still yet to miss a penalty on next gen, which is great. And that made it three 0 but uh, we should not have given that been given that penalty. I mean, it didn't matter because uh, we were going to win the game anyway, really. But but uh, even so, it was just hilarious, the dive by Oscar. It was such a blatant dive, but uh, you see Remy get onto the ball, and uh, heel to heel flicks around the goalkeeper and just uh, skill passes the ball into the back of the net to make it 4-0, uh, which is how the game finished as well. So I was glad to get another win, and uh, wins all round. That's the best thing about it. But um, like I said, online single matches, man, I just feel so much more comfortable. But uh, as always, guys, a uh, big thank you for watching today's video. Uh, I really hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, uh, please consider leaving a like. It's much appreciated. The likes really do help my channel out, and they 
only take a second just to scroll down and click that like button or if you're on your phone and tap the screen and tap the like button it really does help my channel out and um, yeah I will see you for the next episode of my ultimate team very soon